spring has sprung. It's an absolutely gorgeous day, so I'm going to do a little bit outside. There's a plant I picked up from the dump the other day. Hello, kitty. Look how big he's getting. Hello, kitty. Ah. Meow. There's my boy. Yeah, sit with Diesel. So I'm going to show you a fig that I picked up the other day. At the moment it looks a bit sad. It's um, There's no branches or hardly any leaves or anything left on it and it was bare rooted. I just got it out of a pile of rubbish when I went to dump something at the dump. I had the trailer on and I saw it in the green pile um, with all the rubbish and I pulled it out and brought it home. Sat it in a bin of water for a couple of days to give it a good drink and now I'm going to pot it up. It's really big so I'm going to turn the bin into a pot. I just drilled a couple of holes in the bottom, about half a dozen little holes, about that big. A couple in the middle. So I put a couple of holes in there, just an old plastic bin that I've had kicking around for a while. So I've put a little bit of potting mix in the bottom already and then I'm going to sit it straight in. So this is a poor old fig that I found. Um, not a fig like a fruiting fig, a fig like ficus. So you can get to all, all different types of ficus. So there is still green in it. It's got a couple of leaves. It was bare rooted. So I sat it in water for a couple of days to really um, give it a good drink and soak it up, let it get a bit of water back into it. Now I'll put it in its pot. Just got to try and wriggle all that new dirt in amongst the roots and get it right in so it covers up all the roots. These figs behind me, they were actually the same. I picked them up out of a green pile at the dump about five years ago. And I did the same thing with them. Originally they looked like this and now they look like this. So here's one I prepared earlier. Within a span of five years, I've got it to look like this. And then I've got another one I picked up at exactly the same time as this one over the other side. Let's have a look at it. Have a look at this beauty. Isn't she a ripper? So this one's the same, about five year old. About five years ago I brought it home and it looked just like that one I was showing you. Um, nothing but a stump, all bare rooted. And I put it in a pot, watered it up, looked after it and then I've repotted it twice since then. It just keeps growing, goes crazy. All right, now back to this guy. Looking, looking a bit worse for wear, that's for sure. But I know if I look after him and um, give him a bit of attention, he will come back. I've got one bag of potting mix in there. It's not going to be enough, but I'm having trouble getting it through the roots, so I'm going to hose it in. There we go, that's made a bit more room, got the dirt down more. Uh, so with that soil down now, I can fit some more in.
So I've just done the same thing again with the next bag of potting mix. Just tipped it on top, worked it all down, and now I'm gonna wet it all up, and this will be the last big water, and then I'll let it sit. So we make sure it's really wet, put heaps of water on it and then the water will seep through and any air pockets in there, the air should work its way back up to the top and those little air pockets, the dirt will fall into it, make it all really nice and secure, full of dirt. Once we get all of the air out, we can let it sit. Alright, we've done plenty of videos where we've rescued animals and wildlife. I thought I'd do a video where we rescue a plant. So, we'll um, keep you updated on this little fella, the fig tree. And that's how you rescue a tree from the dump. Thanks for joining us everyone. Remember, take time for the simple joys. Bye.